Welcome back, my friends, to another YouTube video. People can try to steal your energy away. What I mean is, me being a light worker, I draw unwanted attention at times because I am a female. What do I mean? These men were attracted to my flame not because of what I was showing from my spirit blog, but instead was only here for the skin. These people pulled the wool over my eyes, tried to steal my energy away. This has happened to other light workers. It is not just myself. I do know this. I have encountered a person saying the same thing that I said. These people came for the wrong reasons. They pulled the wool over our eyes. We found out the true reason why they were watching and following us on YouTube or on Facebook. These were false seekers of the truth. And to my response is, when you find out that these people are fake, why they are really here, you notice that these people try to feed on your energy because they are here for the wrong reasons. These people were sheep. They think they are here for the right reasons, but after a quick conversation, the true reasons why they came here came to light. I know I have worded that horribly, could have worded that better. In other words, they said they were promoting to my light worker stuff, um, commented, do not let these trolls get to you, um, continue your work forward uh, both of both of these people commented gave me compliments to that sense only for the true reasons came to light after they fooled me being a light worker this is nothing new to me no this is not a rant this is a reflection to say People will try to feed on your energy by promoting a good sense only for you to later discover the true intentions. Therefore, these people pulled the wool over your eyes. That is what I am saying. These people are shadow workers. They fool you only to then show the true intentions later. They try to steal your energy, but when you see them for who they really are, why they are here, what happens? You block them, and after you block them, what do you notice? your energy goes back up because these people can not feed onto you anymore. These people cannot feed on you anymore. And that is what I noticed after I blocked these two idiots, these two false fakes. Shame on you for fooling me. Shame on you 
for coming here for the wrong reasons, fooling me that you were seeking to be enlightened. However, that was not the case. You fed on my energy. Shame on you. Light workers stand and are light, proud and strong. We will never stop our work for no one. We will continue to push on no matter what, even if we have false people for the false reasons why they follow us in the first place. Again, worded that wrong. They are here because of skin, not because of the light worker knowledge. They are not here to be enlightened. They are here because of the skin. This goes to an untrained eye. What I mean. I will back down to no one. I will block you. If I find out your true intentions and will stop you from feeding on my energy. I will continue to fight upwards and to rise higher. I know I will draw attention from fakes who are here for the skin. That is inevitable. There are going to be people like that. I cannot prevent that from happening. All I can do is block them and prevent them from feeding on me anymore. And that is what I have done. And is why I am showing this with all of you. If you have bullies, do not let them continue to feed on you. Fight them by standing up for yourself or get an adult to help you if you are in school. Tell someone that they are bullying you. Tell someone, be it your parents or your school teachers or a social worker, these people can probably help you. Because I had a situation while a person was bullying me. I told the social worker, the social worker helped. That person never bullied me again. He actually lied to the social worker, saying what the why he was talking to me in that way. It was a misunderstanding, he claimed, but I know that is false. He lied to the social worker. But that is he'll say because the social worker told me what he told her. However, he stopped and I am thankful for that, for the social worker to stop him from bullying me any further. However, that is not the case for two classmates. I should have told someone rather than put up with the nonsense. Did I? I let them do whatever they wanted, ignored them. I was a mute to them, but they pressed on and continued to bully me. I refused to stoop to their level and to prevent them from feeding on my energy. But they continued to bully me. Because obviously they were afraid of what I was. They could see that I was an alien because I did not belong in the clique. Therefore, since I was not in the social network, I needed to be bullied by them. People will do this throughout the world. It is a thing. It is probably uncommon in Japan, I have heard. Because they, their culture is completely different than the US. Therefore, I believe that you won't get the same 
bullies, though it would be a different type of bully. Personally, I don't know. I can just go by what I have seen in anime, which is mostly fantasy, but who knows, it could be based on a real story. I just don't know. But that is on a side note. People will always bully someone, feeding on their energy until you stop them, until you fight them off, or get an adult to help you solve the matter. But even then, even then, people will still continue to bully you. Because I have seen this on the news. A person went, their mother went to the school to, say, to stop this bully. The school did nothing because the bullying continued. They got their mother involved, their parents involved. Nothing changed. People just don't give a flying flip. People will continue to bully no matter what, if you don't fight them back. But even then, that can be wrong, because fighting usually does nothing but promote more fighting. You will have to find a way to stop them from bullying you. I just do not know what that is. But for me, the social worker stopped it. For the other two, I, when I said nothing to an adult, other than move the locker from one end to the other end, that did nothing. These people will continue to bully me, even outside of school. They tried. If they see me in the store, which has happened before, they just stare at me like, ugh. Like that. Like, Billy, why are you here? Ew, get away from me. People will constantly bully you, no matter what. All you can do is block them online, if you can't block them in person. Or, go to the- ooh, I know. Order a restraining order on this person if they refuse to stop bullying you. Go to the courts. Have them do something. But, with that, you have to wait a really long time, I've heard, because is like a year behind or something, from what I've heard. It like takes forever to get anything done with the courts. Um, but that is an option. Get the cops involved. Get a restraining order on this person. Do something. Do anything. I know fighting can probably make it worse, but there might be a spell, a Wiccan spell, or something, a Prager spell, anything. I just didn't have those tools when I was bullied. I let them say all these things to me. I said nothing to these people who bullied me. I was a mute, did not speak a word to them, and yet they continued onward to bully me. I should have probably tried to go to the social worker, someone, and say, hey, I'm being bullied by these two people, even though I say nothing to them, I draw no attention to myself, and they bully me. Help me. Or, like I said, get the cops involved. Get a restraining order. Again, physical fighting is will promote more fighting. Maybe, sometimes, if you do fight that person saying, Oh, you're a chicken, you won't attack me, then you do, they might back off. But then again, that was a cartoon show, so what chances of that happening? Very slim, but it could happen. Or, you work in the spirit world, fighting them with your energy, controlling your reality to make them stop. That could be a thing, because we do control our reality with our thoughts. It could be a thing. So I know I will continue to draw wrong people to my channel 
who are here for skin, not here for the light worker stuff. I do know that. All I can do is block them online, prevent them from any more addiction, as they put it. They begged me for it. That's when I blocked them, saying, I'm addicted to your skin. Give me more. So I gave them a main message saying, You're a disgusting worm who feeds on your carnal urges and showed me you are a fake fan or something similar. I gave them a main letter before I blocked them, but that shows I stand my ground for myself. And since I blocked them, they can't do anything. They can feel maybe it will tell them this is wrong. You need to stop. You disgust me. Stop it. Or something. I did say that. I did say that. You disgust, sir. You disgust me with this. And then I blocked him. Maybe that will tell the troll, the fake fan, that he needs to respect women properly. Better. Respect them more. Rather than treat them for a particular object. I don't know because I can't see if they will or not after I blocked them. I hope that they learn the lessons from my mean nasty messages. It's not really a, a rant because I said you disgust me with this, uh, so maybe that will help them learn the lessons and to see they were in wrong to do that to me. However, that is probably not the case because they came here for the wrong reasons to begin with. All I can do is hope that they learn the lessons. More times than not, they don't. But that is not my problem. All I can do is press forward and in hopes to help you to say, if you are being bullied, do something about it, be it a restraining order, some sort of magic spell, not a curse, not a curse because that will come back at you to twice as hard. Curses are very dangerous. Um, karma is a thing. That's why I said twice as, twice as hard. I didn't curse them. That's not what I meant when I said spirit and the spirit world attack them with your energy. I said control your reality to make them stop literally do that to like to the point of um imagine that they no longer bully you until it comes true that could happen because again we control our reality and this is not a curse there could be a prayer spell that you could do ask your your deities or your guardian angel or something and ask them to help you that could do something I personally don't know because I the only prayer I did was a protection spell for myself around the energies around my physical body that did that does not help on the internet because these people will come no matter what However, I did purge the negativity on the YouTube when I did read that vlog that I made from my heart. I know that reading it aloud on the channel did do something. However, these people were here before I did that vlog. And maybe that is why I saw them for who they were after I read that uh, prayer projection prayer that I made and read. Maybe it did help somehow. It is a thing. It is a possibility. Um, so you have your choices of get the cops involved, the courts, the your gods, your guardian angels, anyone be it in the spirit world or physical to help you banish these 
Dona is. Kind of like a two-part video, really good, motivational, um, very good, very positive, very reinforcing. Again, not event on the first part of the fake fan, because then I went into the whole bully, what you can do, and fight them off, prevent them from feeding on you. So, again, this video is really, really powerful, powering, inspiring, motivational, very good very blessed in so i know i've done a good job because i went into really good a good video was made um that that's how i can how i can describe what how i see this video how i see it it very helpful very motivational inspiring job well done so yes I thank you for your time and until we meet again, my friends.